Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, I stand uh, and rise to remember Frank Barbaro. Uh, I got to meet Frank Barbaro as a boy. He was somebody who would come to my house and talk about politics and talk about issues. Sometimes I'd get to meet him with two of his colleagues who I know that he respected so much, uh, Joe Ferris and Mike Pesci. And the thing that I always remembered about Frank was not only was he a person who would fight for working people, would champion progressive causes, but his independence, his sense of decency, his sense that it was important to not only uh, do what you thought was right and to represent your community, but to be uninhibited by outside or other political forces. Uh, and his decency, his big personality, his ability, I'd never met somebody when I was a young boy who could talk about being a longshoreman, could talk about the plight of working people, but then go and quote poetry in the next breath. He was a wonderful man. He was a man who was always very kind to my family. And I'm just glad that I was able to stand and remember him for this moment today. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.